The song is called Chalk Dust, dedicated to all my fellow educators. We're special, one of a kind, but yet we're a dying breed. Undervalued by most, but yet we're the ones most people need. Noble and proficient, a high level of expertise, special abilities, and a vast array of qualities. Inspirational motivators, disciplinary tacticians. The success of every child hangs on our everyday decisions. So many trials and tribulations within the walls of a room overshadowed all the victories on the horizon they loom. Many sacrifices are made on a personal level. Is the system the real devil or are there just several? Nobody really cares just as long as we produce. If we try to give a suggestion, it's really of no use. Day after day, we work harder than most. Rewarded, not often, that's just the way it goes. Nobody understands the position we're all in. No witnesses to greatness, so now the day begins. Temptation to quit when overwhelmed with the task of creating an atmosphere where no one is truly last. The bar steady rises, no surprises or gifts. We're driven to push past the limits of all these kids. It's hard to make a difference in a business like this. When support is aborted, then we're shorted to live. Enthusiastic exploits blow away like the wind when we're told that the workload is not a minimal sin. Abstract attitudes open dialogues that burns. Then everybody suffers and nobody learns. So who's the one to blame? No real names are ever mentioned. People scrutinize my soldiers with the worst kinds of intentions. They don't really know what it takes for us to excel to propel young people out of an intellectual hell. Appreciation seldom given, unforgiven no trust, portraying the high value of worthless chalk dust. The error of my ways means I gave it all my best. Stress is the byproduct of taking too many tests. No less are the deeds that are intended to help. No need to intervene. I can speak for myself. It's rough when you're not ready to handle the move. 180 days on stage with everything to lose. Navigating the normal. What a brilliant collaboration of delaying the inevitable failures of children in our nation. Such dedication for wages that are meager. Your wish of getting rich makes you a daydream believer. There is no pain reliever when the reality hurts. Expectations get higher while the test scores get worse. Now I'm ready to burst, overloaded from the data. Escape from the classroom, now I'm considered a traitor. Hard to forecast if things will ever get any better. Just like the weather right now, it seems like never. So let's summarize the feelings of daily teaching of youth. Rewarding to say the least, at the least there's no real proof. No use to complain or point blame for all the reasons why classroom teachers put through more changes like the seasons. One week of appreciation for a career that we all love. Extra money to be had, but we're not the ones they're thinking of. My resolve is never questioned, my patience always tested. My attitude is mostly good even when the body hasn't rested. Complaints are a byproduct of my weakness and stress. Your tolerance and your patience, man, they no longer mesh. Just trying to be the best, I perform for the masses to eradicate the nonsense that manifests in these classes. In the midst of hall passes, lesson plans and reports, I'm not feeling the love, man, it keeps coming up short. We're unappreciated and misunderstood individuals. When it comes to being supported, it's just like we're invisible.